What up everybody? Sean here. Got another video. So I got my little Ranger pickup that I haul my bike in. And online I see a lot of people loading their bikes the wrong way in a truck. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. The way I do it, I think it's the correct way. Been doing it for years, had no problems. And it doesn't it does not compress your forks for long periods of time. Well, it, it doesn't compress your forks at all, but you do not want to compress these for a long period of time, seals and stuff. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. I had a yeast fork here. I had a day of riding, so I'm ready to load up and I figured I'd make a video. So we got one tie down in the back left and one in the front right. So they're ready to go when I uh, get up here. It's just me. Put the uh, ramp on the right side. Bike stand here so I can step up. It won't be that big of a step. By myself. These are another great thing that you put on your bars so when you go put tie downs they don't the tie downs aren't on your bars metal to metal and they won't damage anything because these will stay put. You just loop them through, cinch them down, and won't, this won't tear up any of your cables. In my opinion, these are a must-have item. They usually get me a little bit of a run. Unless I have a hill, then I can back up to a hill. Step right up here. So what we're gonna do. We're going to put the front tire in the corner here. Then we're going to pick up the back end and swing it around. And that's how it should look. Like if you set it there, it'll just stand up by itself. I'm not even touching it. This also allows you to shut the tailgate so nothing falls out. If you put long ways, you can't shut the tailgate. Let's see the back one. And doing this, you don't even have to pull these real tight. Let's give it a little cinch. So there it is. Next thing is, gonna put your ramp in. Mine does, does not fold. So I gotta put it in the opposite direction. That way the tailgate can close. This goes on top. And then you start piling. I usually put the cooler in the back because it's the heaviest and then everything else goes kind of in there. As you can see Forks aren't compressed at all. So this isn't gonna go anywhere. At all. I've even had these tie downs come loose and it still won't fall over doing turns and stuff. But yeah. There you guys go. Just a little tip if anybody's wondering. Take it easy on your uh, forks, guys.